not having to deal with any of that new band stuff that nobody knows or cares about. No grind floor questions. No, so this is classic. This is classic rock. It would be a good question for you. Robert Miller, uh, the world famous producer of the first Montrose album that we know. The uh, also produced all the awesome Van Halen albums was a member of what One Hit Wonder band from the 60s? Well, you didn't say the producer's name. Well, because I was you hoping that was going to be the question. No, you should know that. Well, you can tell everybody. Ted Templeman. Right. Now, what band was he in? What 1960s One Hit Wonder band was he in? I know he produced the Doobie Brothers, but I don't think the Doobie Brothers were One Hit Wonder. No. I don't know. Harper's Bazaar. Who? Harper's Bazaar. 59th Street Bridge feeling groovy. Oh, of course they did. Give him a prize. Thank you. Where's the box, Victoria? Oh, New Alter Bridge record. I love that record. Those guys will be on that metal show a week from tonight. Mark and Miles. Do we have another prize? Two more prizes. My name is Paul. I'm from the Please move the mic up. I can't hear you. Paul, thank you for coming to Houston. Hey, Paul, thank you for being uh, on and uh, uh, being here. One of your. I also thank you for returning your uh, emails, too. Oh, so. Thankfully, I returned everybody's emails in here. No, and not, not just one, one thing. Not to rub it in, but in 1989, I heard the original Blue Murder perform here in Houston. The original three member group. Really? In this, in this room? Not in this room, it numbers in Houston, Texas, uh, in 1989. So I know you're a big fan. I love it, yeah. yeah. Anyway, it, uh, my question is in 19 He's pulling stuff out of his wallet, too. I don't know what's going on. In 1983, uh, Billy Sheehan, Billy Sheehan in 1983. Uh, with his group Talus, of course, composed a, a bass solo entitled NV4-3345. That's, that's the name of his bass solo. It actually has a hidden meaning to it. Would you happen to know it? Or would you know it? Would you know it? Help yourself to Victoria, sir. Well, it's... <laughs> what, what is it? Tell me, because I don't know. No. If you have the recording at home, if anybody has a recording at home, you can look at it. But if you turn the, the title over, it spells out Sheen. Sheep? Sheen. Like Sheen. 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 It spells, it's a, it's a series. I thought you were going to tell me it said something about grizzly bears, like no. the Def Leppard. If you look at the title, if you have the title at home, look I think up. everybody in this place has smoked too much dope back in the day. I don't know what it is. Let me see. Uh, new Montrose. Yeah, that's a new uh, posthumous movie. Yeah. Montrose. Look at that Montrose stuff. When they were, I didn't know there was a band playing Montrose before. That's uh, awesome. What's up, baby? How's it going? JD, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Can we get a hell yeah, baby? The owner gets the last question. Well, I got now, wait, 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 wait. If I know the answer... So first question is, what's that young lady's name? Victoria. Veronica. Oh my god! <laughs> All right, that's good. That's a good start. Is it? <laughs> I gotta check my notes. <laughs> yeah, it is Veronica. All right. Just in case you forgot, I was checking. <laughs> I'm sorry, Veronica. All right. Number two. That I'm wasn't a question. <laughs> a couple of quick things. Uh, so you haven't Shit. been down to Houston. You haven't hung out in Houston. Is that correct? This is like the first time I've ever hung in Houston. Now, what's your favorite place in Houston now? Con? Con? 
Alex or Paul Malloy. Check it out, it's on that. for you coming from uh, uh, East Coast. We both go for the East Coast. And it's, uh, are you uh, a big fan of Cream, Eric Clapton and them back in the old days? No, even I'm not that old. Ah, <laughs> Jerry Seriously, Anderson. I mean, that was just a little before my time, but you want to go ahead, you go ahead. Well, I was just seeing if you knew uh, a fellow guy from the Bronx. He uh, produced the Disraeli Gears and two or three of their albums. And he was from another famous band, bass player. Hold on. Hold on. His wife killed him. I hold on, hold on, hold on. Was it Felix Papillardi? Yeah! yeah! Drinks for everybody! Yeah! All right, I need a big Long Island iced tea and a hundred straws. Let's go. And the pressure was on. I can't wait for you guys. It was drinks on the line. Thank you for coming out and joining us, Andy. You're a rock star. Just, um, let me get my notes. Hold on, as we wrap up. First of all, thank you, Veronica. Seriously, I wrote it down. Also, uh, the band that, uh, the bands that are on here, Lights Out, who did, who did Montrose earlier, and I'm gonna come back and do some UFO, a band I just can't stand. And then Fallacy will be playing. I want to thank uh, JD. I want to thank John for having me. Honestly, it's the first time I've ever. Yeah. It's the first time I've ever been on laying over at the airport. The first time I've ever spent some time here. And uh, honestly, when I heard there was an opportunity to come here, I was so excited because on my satellite show on Mondays, I may be getting more calls from Houston than anywhere else. Which means, A, you have good taste in radio, and B, that means your radio here maybe isn't as good as it should be. Coming up a fucking hour, right? We better yet put me on for three hours a week. Anyway, um, but thank you most of all to all of you guys for coming out and, and, and being here tonight. I mean, this is just awesome for me. When I come out and do this stuff, honestly, every time I go into them, I expect it to be like the scene in Spinal Tap at the record store where there's two people there. And the guy's like, go ahead, kick my ass. Somebody's gonna be there. And to come out and to see all you guys here and hanging out with me is, I'm beyond thankful. So thank you all so much for hanging with me on Saturday. I appreciate it. We hope to come back again soon, and uh, we're going to go back, take a second, have a drink. Some great live music is going to come up on the stage, and then I will be back in that corner room. No, no way. Back this way. Back this way, I know. we got a merchandise boost back here, and we're going to be signing autographs and books. But people, just take your time and relax. He's hanging out with us. I'm hanging, and uh, you can buy both books, and you can buy their shirts and stuff available. And I'll sit there and sign anything you want. And if you already have a book that you bought previously, you just want it signed, there's absolutely no charge for that, of course. But if you want to buy a book, they're both available here on site. Thank you, guys. I'll see you over there. I appreciate it so much. And happy birthday to Happy birthday to Jennifer. You, you, your birthday presents, you want a picture of me? I hope somebody does better for you than that, but I'll be happy to do that.